we have uh, three connections, main connections between uh, GDPR, general regulation on the protection of personal data, and NIS directive, the second legal act which regulate on the European Union single market rules um, uh, of the protection European Union against the cyber attacks. The first, the main important connection is the subject of regulation. Both regulations occur information. Both regulations regulate the rules, organizational and technological measures of the protection of information. The second one um, is the reason of both regulations is to increase the public sensitivity and uh, public awareness um, of the protection of information at all. Also the privacy, but not only privacy, in the broadest sense the information. And uh, the third one is um, how uh, the Polish people, it's from our a single Pol Pol Polish market, how the Polish people treat both regulation. Unfortunately, uh, from the point of view that is, not from the point of view privileges, much less from the point of view privileges. It's why as important is education, it's why Polish government and especially Ministry of Digital Affairs decided to conduct something like um, a media campaign, organizing um, a lot of workshops, conferences, um, preparing guidelines which translate, uh, for example, for entrepreneurs how to understand uh, rules of NIS directive and GDPR especially. In Poland, regarding to GDPR, um, uh, the huge scale of misunderstanding and, and misinterpretation um, we call the road of panic uh, or road of absurdities. We are fighting with, uh, with two um, uh, preparing that guidelines. But we cannot forget that NIS directive and GDPR should be treat like one big legal, huge legal act which care about Ladies our information in the European Union. We are